Last day on set here. How are you, man? Good Sam in the house? I think I could rock your hair? Hell no, I couldn't. Don't even act like I could. I got such a fat head if I did that, my head would look this wide. I've got a really big forehead, so I need some tall fringes. Ah, so see, I need to create more length. Yeah. And yes, I do have some lip gloss on because I just was at makeup. And there, where David is at right now, getting his makeup done. How's it going in there? How's everyone doing? You guys good? You're good? Going to med school with Stanford biology major? Such a smarty. I was a biology major, but at Dixie State. A little bit different than Stanford. So, um, yeah, we're gonna wrap up today. Uh, maybe throw a house party. Definitely need a workout. Here's the problem. Here's the problem with being a Gymshark athlete. The problem with being a Gymshark athlete, the one bad thing about being a Gymshark athlete, because you do these photo shoots and you're on set with weights, and you're kind of working out, you don't always feel like going back to the gym later on in the day. So you kind of just kind of make yourself do that. I have yet to work out this week, and it's Thursday. It's Thursday and I've worked out once this week. I did back. Um, so I need to go to the I need to go to the gym, and the hotel gym is pretty sweet. We're gonna throw a house party there, a raging house party in Los Angeles. We definitely should. Alex gonna DJ it. Yo, look at Alex's hair. What a handsome kid, like. A little brother over here. Learning from the best. My hair. I definitely need a haircut. I'm gonna go see my my dude Aaron. He cuts my hair in Beverly Hills. We're gonna go see him today. The pre pump up. This is the pump up before we shoot the pump up. What kind of freaking wizardry is that? <laughs> Gotta get the pump up to then work out for the shots. Are you are you gonna lint roll me? Yeah. Hey, um, excuse me. Hey Steve. Hey Steve. Have you seen this guy's sweatshirt yet? Does that, does that translate? It does. That's how it looks in person too. It just messes cool, right? with your head. You want to give your friend's brand a shout out? Yeah, Milk Shop. M-I-L-Q Shop. Check her out. She's incredible. Original What's her name? Yeah. Marissa. Marissa, you make some crazy ass clothes. All right, let's get back to work. Sorry, oh, we're shooting. We're shoot photographer extraordinaire I'm today. I'm at work. This, this guy. This guy's good. He actually shot this photo right here. Cannot work under these conditions! Mariah Carey? Get it. This is the worst part about being a germ shock athlete. The worst part. Being on set with hooligans like this. Get it. Oh, that is some really good dancing there, Steve. Get it. Oh, get it. Get it. Oh, you did it though. Donnie, where are you at? Donnie? Yeah, I mean, if, if there's one guy on set that I think. Wait, that's racist. If there's one guy on set that I think can dance. You're like, check out this shit, shit though. That looks like you suck. And when you, you do this, you do it long enough. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's a funny one. Can we see that one real fast? Yeah. For the camera? Hold on. We were showing him how to do some bicep <laughs> drills. And that one's like. If you do it long enough. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me of, If I had big biceps, that'd be like an Arnold one. And then I'm gonna move position and then you can kind of move more. Oh! 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 I think once they see him, they might actually end up using some of these, but... Okay. All right. We're good. Am I going to go uh, now over to the Airbnb? Okay. Don't think too highly of it. It's just a shitty little I heard it's nice. I heard everyone was down playing the Airbnb. We're going to get buck wild there tonight, right? Buck wild. Buck wild. Buck wild. Buck wild. We, we were here for like 20 minutes. Don Juan and me killed it. So we're, we're bouncing now. Look who we have here. Hi! Oh, Karina's lip gloss is popping. For those of you guys that don't know, um, Karina's coming out with a... Wait, can I say that? Yeah, no, can we say that? so serious. She's gonna be coming out with her own lip gloss. I'm actually... I'm wearing it right now. And the makeup lady did not put it on me. Um, she's gonna be a doctor. She's going to Stanford. You're amazing. Thank you. If you're run for president, I'm voting for you. So. <laughs> she did it. She did it. She did. Oh, and David? Yeah, I have a couple. Okay, here we go. 
as a girl, as a girl, would you rather? Oh, you're not putting this. I have no girls that watch my videos. Yeah, but look at good. look at David's. You can't you can't mess with David's structure. Look at this kid. My mom watches your videos. Your mom does? Yeah, what's up, David's mom? How you doing? If you were Karina, would you rather? Oh my gosh, we're done. We're out of here. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go with David. I live for awkward. I'm gonna go with David. <laughs> I live for moments like this. She really does. She has a way of making everything just turned up. Level 10. It might be at a level 7, it's now a level 10. Alright, we out? Let's bounce. Cut. Worst part about Team Shark. All these behind the scene cameras, you don't know which one to look at. Am I here? Am I here? Okay, I'm ready, Steve. Okay. Are you gonna ask me something? Um, or am I just talking could, about could you, it? Could you close like the behind the scenes? We've like, uh, had four days shooting here okay. in LA. We've had four days shooting here. That's a wrap. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. All right, guys. Fourth and final day here in sunny LA. The weather's been great. I bet these Gymshark guys love coming over from England because the weather is always better in the U.S. Um, it's been just—it's been a good crew. It's been a good set. Um, the largest production Gymshark has ever done. So hopefully you guys love the finished product. You guys love seeing this. Um, super excited for everything to come. And uh, if you guys like this video, make sure you subscribe to this Gymshark channel. Okay? I'm out of here. You guys have a good one. We'll see you next time. About as good as I got right now. Awesome. That's clean. I think this is dirty. Come here. Come here. The transition. Yo, I'm pissed. I mean, we're staying in a nice hotel, so I can't really complain. <laughs> Look at the Airbnb. Real talk, though, Lex and I were talking about this. We are going to start just doing Airbnbs as a group, a team. So we would all just stay in an Airbnb together. I think that would be better for content. Just be crazy, wild parties. Even if it's all just the dudes staying in one and all the girls staying in the other, if we start mixing and matching, bad things would happen. Bad, bad thing. Karina, you guys saw. You guys saw her. She's at a level 10 all the time. So we're gonna go in here right now. We gotta film whatever we gotta film with Don Juan here. Don's, Don's been great. Be here. And then we're gonna be jumping in this pool. Let's go in. Let's go in and just take over this house. Yo! Oh, we just rocked up to the house, to the crib. We here. Where's the party at? It's inside? Yeah. I like it. Welcome to my my room. So this is where all the love making happens. None of the love making happens. Um, but this is the bedroom. So I went with this little cool little designer piece behind the headboard. And then every morning I wake up and this is where I get my. You guys check out the you guys check out the gym. Do you want to see the gym? You. Jim? Can you see? Katie. Katie. You just called me. You. Hey you. <laughs> My name that. is Katie. Katie. Do you want to see the gym? Yeah. This is where I work out every day. <laughs> this is crazy. This would, be a, this would be a great place. Oh, it's hot. Oh, it is hot. It'd be perfect though. You'd get yeah. super sweaty in here. You could throw a couple more things. But oh, this is, this is, this is meant. It's movable. It's doable. It's kind of nice that it's right off the bedroom, so there's no excuse. Yeah, it, it's just wake up, get it done, yeah. jump in the pool. What do you think, Katie? Um, it's okay. <laughs> It's, Same better. You know. Katie's bougie. Mm. My, I, so in Utah, so this place probably costs like we said about seven mil. In Utah, this would be one and a half. The worst part about being a Gymshark athlete, worst part is definitely the early ass wake up call. For some reason, all week long, somebody's had the 6 a.m. call time. And it's because, because you don't want me having late nights or because you knew I was responsible uh, to wake up early? Yeah, you couldn't be here on Monday and then you missed your flight. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. Wait, hold up a sec. Hold up a sec now. Me missing the flight had nothing to do. We weren't going to shoot that day. <laughs> right, but I was at, I, I was work. I was at a retreat with 40 no, people that day. Did you plan to punish you? Yeah, it's just like spite. It did, so I couldn't have flown out Sunday. I was I was making sure people got their flights. So we flew out Monday. So I'm about, I'm about ready to throw some throw some hands in here. So that, that dropped two days ago. It hopefully hopefully it's up. Um, hopefully it's still still there. Links in the description. Three. Stop. Two. Nipple. Oh shit. Stop. Nipple. Nipple. <laughs> Okay, three, two, one, action. Hey, you excited for uh, our training session tomorrow? 
Mmm, cheat day. Mm, I like it. Okay, see you tomorrow. <laughs> Try that again. Three, two, one, action. Hey! Big training session tomorrow. Make sure you rest up. That's not bad. And three, two, one, action. Big training session tomorrow. Make sure you rest up. Cheat day. <laughs> it's when you talk with your mouth full, that's the best bit. <laughs> that's good. Yeah, that's good. I like that, man. That's a wrap. Yes, not quite as good as that kettle corn. The worst part about being a gym shark athlete? The grapes. They only have red grapes, not, not green grapes. It's the worst part about being a gym shark athlete. Thinking about when I get mad at gym shark for making me wake up early? I can still be working at Texas Real Fields. That's what I think. Yeah. Whitney was the worst job you ever had. No, there's no way. American Eagle. No, Bath uh, and Body Works. Ooh, retail just sucks. Bath and Body Works was the worst. I was the door guy at Abercrombie and Fitch. Oh, of course you were. <laughs> That's so you. I, I told them I didn't want to wear boxers though because they were gonna put you in boxers. You wanted to get boxers and a, a hat. I said I'll wear jeans you, and flip flops and no shirt, but I'm not wearing boxers with a cricket and then. Yeah, it's like the door. Have you? Yeah, they wanted at Christmas time Santa hats and boxers. The my actually my worst job. I was 16 years old. Did you guys have Crofto Pups where you were at? Probably not. It's a corn dog place, and I was in the back putting like the bologna, like the hot dog, just yeah. before you cook it on sticks. That's all I should just said a native American word for that. <laughs> bologna, bologna, hot corn dog. dogs, Pronto <laughs> Pups. Hot dog. <laughs> What is this food? I got to eat as many Pronto Pups as I wanted. And like the first week, I probably had like an average like four a day. And then after that, I had some. Silver Toyota Corolla. How's it going? Steve? Yep. We got in and we got out. Yeah, that was quick. Quick day. Enough time to actually work out. Usually, I said the worst part about being a Gymshark athlete is you never have time to work out. It's 12.30 and we're done. So that excuse is no longer valid. Let's go work out. So as far as hotel gyms go, this is probably top 10 that I've been in. Vegas has some crazy ones that throws the whole countdown off. Um, but basically you got free weights over here. They got, I think 845s. So we're gonna be putting that to the test. No, we're not. Um, we have treadmills, we have dumbbells, we have this, Machine here, it's a good one. It has a lot of different cables you can do. We have a wild Karina in the back. That's a hot fire flames outfit there, that's for sure. And then you have this crazy ass ab machine, which is absolutely pointless if you ask me. Just have a wall or a person right there because you're supposed to like throw it into that and they come back to you. How lazy are you? And then this thing's pretty cool. Alec and I did like a punch test the other day. This machine isn't made for punch testing, but we put it to the test. Didn't we? Did you? Well, I gotta try to beat it now. Just once. 30 seconds. Long leg. What'd you get? 178. 178. I think I broke my wrist. Ow! Your turn. Okay, punch it. That was horrible. What? You are hitting too hard. You're freaking such a beast. Hit in the middle. This one? No, I'm saying, saying the middle of the thing. Oh, yeah. Keep that stats. 152. Not bad, babe. 147. 165. Ooh. 160. Whoa, whoa, is there kicking involved in this? Is that how you feel like when you're editing a video and like, I'm like, oh. I see Steve's face and I'm like, Get it, get it, son. Get it, son. Whoa, easy, vegan. Easy, you're an angry vegan. All right, so the other day on Instagram, I posted a fail of this, and everyone was like, oh, get up and do it again. To be honest, I was too exhausted to get it. Like, my forearms were just really tired. So, uh, I'm gonna try it today, right now. Ow, ow! That hurt. You got this. It's pretty much downhill from here, brother. Oh! <laughs> Damn it! I'm gonna have to try that again. I'm 0 for 2 on that son of a gun. 
Look at you ready to swim. Oh, All that fat news, we start doing that. Oh, come on, Steve, you got this. I believe in you. We got the swing going, I like it. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know about the swing. <laughs> You are this so close, you are so close. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> One more, brother. <laughs> I'm done. Okay, I'm done. Alright guys, using the Fitness Culture app, we do have the eight week summer sizzle that is open for registration now. So, eight weeks, giving away $20,000 in prizes to the top 10 winners. Um, cash, things like, just a bunch of prizes. You guys can check it out. I'll put the description in here. But basically, uh, you either get the $99 package, and for that eight weeks, it's either $99 or $49. That $99 is pretty much our premium app membership. You get everything they do. Um, so all the workouts, six days a week. You get your mobility, nutrition, um, and then the basic one, the 49 is just the basic one. So you're still gonna get all the workouts. You're just not gonna get that extra stuff. So. It gives you a glimpse into this app right here. Every video or every exercise comes with a video, but everything's based off of maxes. So today we're doing overhead press, 80%. Six, uh, so we got six reps at 80%, 83%, 86, 89, and 92%. So that's overhead press. Super set with a bat wing row, uh, five sets of six with the tempo on there. Um, seated military press. We're gonna do 12, 10, 8, as heavy as possible, staying one rep shy from failure. Then we have the incline rear delt raise that we're supersetting with that for three sets of 12. And then we have kneeling barbell press. It's a, it's a giant set here with a lateral raise and a dumbbell shrug. Three sets of 15 on all of those. So it's kind of like a circuit, rest 60 seconds, and we have three, three rounds of that. And then this cardio, which I'm not gonna do because we've been walking around Melrose for at least 20 minutes. So obviously, the idea is we're supersetting an anterior. So we're pushing there, anterior delt, with a posterior delt there. So we're not pre-fatiguing. So one straight into another, and then 90 seconds rest between these two. So these things are kind of weird. If you guys need dumbbells, do them with a dumbbell. Um, I think the dumbbells go up to 40, 45. So I'm, I got 50s here. I don't know why this gym has them, but you can put your hand inside and I feel like the juggernaut. With, I'm the juggernaut, bitch. Is that his name? I think it's his name. 90% sure. I'm more Arnold pressing. So, you guys can't see this, but I'm supinated to pronated. Yes, two man. balls for hands. Just two black balls floating in the universe. Supersetting that with an incline rear delt raise. I'm gonna go nice and light on this. I keep my chest on the pad. If you guys want to make Arnold press this harder, don't use the back. Like don't have the bench at a 90 degree angle that you can lean back on. If you want to be strongest, do that. But by doing it without, activating a lot more core to stabilize all that swinging. Hey. Ah. Broncos trade pick, who we picking? We got uh, the NFL draft going. Broncos trade pick to Steelers. You know, what are the Steelers doing? Extending Big Ben's contract for two years, 68 million. I'm sure somebody on here is a diehard Steelers fan that's gonna try to explain it, but 
Big Ben should have been done last year. All right, guys, uh, we're about to move into our tri set. So we got three sets of 15 starting off on this barbell, I don't know even what we call it, barbell kneeling press. I call them Cook Willis's, because back in the day, my training partner, Chad Willis, chiropractor Chad, uh, we didn't know what to name these, so we named them now after ourselves. Is that weird? I don't think so. Not at all. Like, what are the Galapagos Islands named after? Pretty sure that dude's last name was Galapagos. Quick fact check that. Um, anyhow, so what we're gonna be doing, this is a anterior delt and upper chest movement. More upper chest um, is gonna be here. More anterior delt would be sitting back more and back further on here. Um, more chest you want, you're gonna be here and squeezing. So I'm gonna go kind of in the middle. I always like, I mean, you can't help but to activate some chest here because your elbows are together. Think about when we start talking about how to activate muscle fibers in the chest, we always talk about squeezing those elbows together. You can, that's, that's right there is chest activation, trying to touch your elbows. I don't know, back in the day we thought we were so funny when we asked girls if they could touch their elbows behind them, like when we were sixth grade. Now you probably get a sexual harassment case for that, so I don't recommend doing that but we thought it was funny in middle school. But try to touch your pecs or your elbows in front of you. That's gonna be all chest. So we're gonna be here, pressing up, using anterior delt and a little bit of chest. 15 reps. All right, moving straight into lateral raises. Three sets of 15. You can do them, I'm actually gonna try them with these. You can do them with dumbbells or on a cable if you want. All right, last thing we got is a dumbbell shrug. Ah, the grip is going before anything else. And I'm blaming those damn, I don't even know what you call those, jump rings, so. Whew. That's a shoulder day. On the road, traveling. Worst part about fitness culture, you can't train in real life gyms. You gotta train in hotels, even if they are super nice. All right, workout's done. Going to go close things out. So we're gonna go hang out. Obligated to go hang out with a bunch of awesome people. My life sucks. All right, like I said, this is the worst part about being a Gymshark athlete. Are you going? Having to hang out with all these <laughs> amazing, amazing people. So, uh, where are you going right now? We're gonna go say bye to Creative. Yeah, I'm going to go say bye to Creative as well. They are in a shack, poor guys. So, we're gonna go say goodbye to them. Where are you guys going? Oh, uh, good seeing you. It's nice to see you. Hi. Hi. What are you doing? Oh, oh he's going to see Avengers. So to Anybody see put spoiler yeah. alerts on this? I probably just invited spoiler alerts. If anyone puts them on there, you're getting banned for life. Hi, brother. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Getting all right, and we're going to hey, and you're gonna go edit this video right here. Yeah, this one. Wild. 